Starship Profile Oberth Class, USS Phaetum Registry Number NCC-611 Originally commissioned as a run-of-the-mill science vessel, the tensions between the Federation and the Klingon Empire led to the USS Phaetum seeing combat in several engagements. After a battle near Arcanus, where the first combat deployment of the Giorgio class proved successful, the Phaetum underwent refit and repair to serve as a long-range reconnaissance vessel. During the tensions leading up to the Kitimer Accords, the Phaetum was loaded with the latest sensor suites. Already intended to be a science vessel, these upgrades served as a testbed for the Starfleet Corps of Engineers to utilize those instruments offensively. The already advanced technology in the Phaetum's hull was amplified in range and accuracy. All of this in the Oberth's nimble space frame allowed for the ship to use sheer speed and evasiveness to evade would-be Klingon attackers as it monitored close to their territory. After the Accords, the Phaetum continued to see service as a utility science vessel. Missions it was sent on included deep surveys and relationship-strengthening diplomatic assistance. Many officers captained the ship through the decades, with each captain's expertise playing a factor in its mission profile. In the mid-24th century, a retrofit program for 23rd century Oberth-class ships commenced, extending their lifetime for about half a century and updating their sensor suites with modern equipment. The Phaetum was one such ship that was refit and continued serving Starfleet, managing to avoid destruction in several major conflicts throughout the chaotic 24th century. Though dwarfed in almost all respects by other contemporary classes, the Phaetum lives on as a science vessel specializing in planetary survey, sent by Starfleet to perform deeper exploration of safe and charted space. Even with lacking firepower and an older generation of scanners, it is a point of pride for new cadets and officers to be assigned to the Phaetum, a ship with a long and storied legacy.